behind them. Not to say they can't drop something still that would be like, oh my god, that's great. I just think it's just a little too on the on the designy side. You you feel me? Do I think I could put a good fit together from the Walmart clothing section? Honestly, no. I really can I I I I like I would like to think that I could do a whole bunch of things, but like a whole bunch of shit, but I really can't I can't actually do it. Nah, it's impossible. If you can't, you don't have good style to be honest. Nigga. Alright, bro. Alright, bitch. You challenge me to style an out from Walmart? No problem. Will you play don't forget that you don't have to tonight. spend a ton of money on your clothes to feel good in them. eBay, Poshmark. Walmart has this great brand called Free Assembly. Shittiest shirt of all time. Play that I love. I got these jeans for $6. Do some boots from Blake McKay, another affordable brand. This fishtail park is also from Walmart. Beanie, beanie from the toy. surplus store. All Zero UV sunglasses. With some jewelry from Etsy. She to me because I never but, had a girl in my 26 years of life. This nigga look like a like a pedophile off of PB Kids. What are we doing? Oh, you think it's easy? Let's see somebody went, else try it. I went to Walmart and got some outfits. Oh my butt like a thug. They got my little gun in the club. Don't worry about me. I'm a thug. Bro. The street nigga get a dime. If you kill a rap nigga, get a dub. Bitch chain on my neck, don't budge. Fucking days loaf like a stud. I went to Walmart and got some outfits. On my butt like a thug. Space Jam. This man got a whole beard and a fake Cuban on his neck. What are we doing? What point are you trying to prove? Because we 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 still. Here's the best home gym equipment. He get home we're gym in equipment. Walmart right now, and they actually have some heat here. Like what? We got DS Easies. Bro, come on, bro. Timu Timu Yeezys at Walmart. Come on, on deck. Now. Wide width. You can't get that with normal Yeezys, right? Yeezy slides and. Come on, bro. Every color, okay. And I'm not even poor. I'm not. I'm not even. I'm not shaming. I'm not saying that you shouldn't, you know what I'm saying, get what you can afford. I'm saying if you can get what you need to get for the proper fit, you shouldn't. Like, why would you do this? You telling me that you can, you telling me that you can make the best out of the outfit. I'm sorry, my brother. It's not possible. Niggas broke, I think that's good. I just think anybody could do better than Walmart. I'd rather go to Payless. I would. I would really genuinely rather go to Payless, or as a kid, I would rather just not go to a public school. Let's go to a religious school. Let's go to a Catholic school. Now, what if your kid gay? Then you fucked. Then you fucked. It's over, nigga. Even if you got a uniform, you just not going back to home. You're not going back home, you know, with the uniform looking the same because they're going to beat the fuck out you, bro. It's going down in here. I'm with the money team. Thrift is way better. Look, man. Okay. And we got the whole wall. Oh, my God. Are these Air Forces? Yeah, it's over, bro. It's over. Now, to the untrained eye, this is good. To the untrained eye, this is great, you know? No, 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 it's not classism. I'm not I'm not even saying like just get get what you can afford always, but I'm saying if you can afford it, why would you go to Walmart? Why would you do this to yourself? The shoes themselves aren't bad. It's what they're imitating that makes the shoe bad. On their own, if Air Force Ones never existed, the shoe itself would be completely fine. You understand what I'm saying here. Don't act oblivious. That's why it's a bad shoe. That's why you don't want to be caught wearing it because of what it's emulating. 
that's going to get you made fun of. Where you could rather you could otherwise just get a cheap shoe. Brands for quality fabrics. I'll send the link. You could otherwise Please just get a cheap shoe. This time cause it's about what we talking about. What are you talking about? Since we talking about clothes, let's get back to the best. No. They from the same warehouse. It don't matter. It ain't about who did it right. It's about who did it first. What other Walmart fits we got? Wait, what is this? Doing a Walmart grocery. Low calorie. I didn't ask about my food choices. You think I'm going to, to kill no, time? See, what if see? we send you some women insta and you can say if they bad, pretty, or not? I'll volunteer as tribute. Send me some women on insta and I can see that's not a good idea. They did not ask to be rated. They did not ask for my opinion about their looks. I'm good. You know what I'm saying? But um, I do have my own, you know what I'm saying? Things that I find beautiful and shit like that. But that's for my eyes, you know. Are we in middle school? Yeah. This is all middle school behavior. I want to go back. Never mind. Whoa. Chat. I'm a cop. Okay, so, but look, no, because here's the situation, right? No. Wait, 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 wait. Just calm down. Let me explain. I told y'all already. I told you all already. I don't even have that shirt anymore. I don't even have that shirt anymore. First of all, first of all, that shirt was given to me. That's the first thing. I didn't, whoever got it, didn't know whoever got it. I need to get me some hellfire, they tough tees. Whoever got it, they didn't give it to me from Walmart. It was a, I think it was an Amazon purchase. It was an Amazon purchase. And then like me wearing the shirt through time, I got an indicate. It's not even the same model slash make of the shirt. I think it was got somewhere completely different. I'm I am I'm current I'm literally currently explaining. I'm literally currently explaining. And so as I was wearing it, I really realized like, yo, like it fits good. You know, it fits it fits it fits well, you know? It's not a bad shirt. That's the difference. It's not a bad shirt. Yours is baseball style. Yeah, like a lot of them you can get baseball style. I didn't go to Walmart to get a shirt. That's not what happened. It was it was got it was it was it was it was acquired. It was obtained on the Internet and then it came to the crib. And then that's how it came into contact with my skin. But um, from what I remember, like I said, it, it I can't control like how many iterations of the shirt were ultimately made. I just know where it ended up like landing on me from where. It's okay, bro. I don't pour. No, it's not about pour. It's just about like this isn't an ex this isn't a shirt exclusive to Walmart. So it's not a Walmart shirt. My anime shirts used to hit harder before anime became mainstream. No, they didn't. I got news for you. Whoever told you that fucking lie. Um Whoa. but what I will say is it's not a Walmart exclusive shirt, you know? So you got to show me something exclusive to Walmart for me, for this to make sense. No, no, no. Don't say it's not indicative of who I am as a person because, like, it's not even, I don't even have anything to represent myself. It's, it's okay. It's okay. The gymnastics, man, it's okay. I'm not even, I'm not even an acrobatic. I'm just showing, I'm, I'm explaining to you how the shirt came in contact with multiple people Sean, good question let's say if you have a nike hat on and air force ones you think it's crazy to have a different shoe brand clothing on like a pullover hoodie or sweats nah bro nike go with everything it's going down and down with the money team. that's like saying you can't wear never mind no nah, whoa that's crazy it's just a lot of shit that you wouldn't mix like would you put potatoes with seafood so we all agree Stranger Things is that girl it's like the Nicki Minaj of TV shows. What do you mean by that? What do you mean yes? Oh brother bro here y'all going being weird again man. Like alright bro y'all got it bro. If that's how y'all eating and no wonder you die. 
Here we go, bro. Uh, dude. No, I'm talking about mashed potatoes, not regular potatoes, bro. I didn't say mashed potatoes. I said mashed potatoes is the one that I was referencing, not regular potatoes, bro. Show us your drip. Nigga, if I showed you In my drip, you fucking kill you. Wear a Adidas fit with Jordans, it drove me insane. Well, those were people that ultimately grew up to be criminals, huh? Pretty sure, right? Yeah, I said potatoes, but I'm saying like mashed potatoes. I didn't mean regular potatoes, bro. I meant mashed. Bro, my fits will put you to shame. I'm going to be honest. Sean, show us the sneaker collection. There is no collection, bro. I don't even wear sneakers like that for real, bro. I'm in a different, like, I'm in a different world now, you know? I wish I could say that I had, like, a collection of J's or some shit. Like, I just, I don't want them. You know, I had my little dunk phase. We got over that real quick. Some shit just, it's not for everybody, you know? I got some cool dunks, some cool, you know what I'm saying? Some cool, uh, some cool J's, you know what I'm saying? Some shit that I think is decent. Some shit that I like to wear, but nah, bro. Like I, I don't, how do I sound? How do I sound? But like, I don't even mean to talk like, like I, I think that like designer shoe wear is just a little bit more my, up my alley because it's it, like, it helps represent some of the fits a little bit better in my personal opinion. You know what I mean? So, I mean, I know, I know, I know like, Bro, like, it's okay, though. No, I'm saying it's so No, 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 no. I, I'm not even trying to say it like that. I mean, like, y'all good. I be seeing y'all fits from time to time. I'm not calling you broke. Oh, here we go, bro. And I touched that nigga. It's going down in here. I'm with the money. I'm just more of a, I'm just more of a, des like, yeah. No, no, no. I, they're gifted. They're gifts. They're gifts. They're gifts from the manufacturer. They're gifts. Can you cook me something, Gordon Ramsay? Speaking of Gordon Ramsay, you about to watch him in a second. Sean always shopping at Gucci. Gonna run out of hangers. All right. I got in a heavy loafers phase. Still, do you like loafers, Sean? They cool, you know. I just don't think that they're representative of who I am as a person. What helps me represent myself, you know. I'm not gonna say it though. You know, like we we good though. Like y'all good. You you keep wearing your your dunks and your jays. And your forces, because I mean, that's really all that you can afford. I mean, that's really all that you can really wear with a lot of your clothing style choices. Like, I'm more of a boot nigga. I'm more of a boot nigga, right? So I like, you know, cold walls, for example. Those are one of my faves when it comes to the boot category. I got a couple off whites when it comes to some boots. You know what I'm saying? Um, there's this other brand of boot that I think is fantastic on some Jonathan Major shit um what else some designer sneakers because i just think they're up my alley you know i like solomon's as well i'm a big fan of asics asics over balenciagas you know what i'm saying if i gotta wear like a chunkier type of shoe obviously i think comfortability wise we talking asics and new balance for example you feel me um shit what else what else do i really be liking for real uh you know classic air force shit you know nothing too crazy you gotta have a new pair every three months or so I'm trying to think of what else it would be uh shit short niggas love boots i mean i'm literally six three in a pair of boots but okay whatever bro um six one without them but oh, whatever bro what is this i'm not clicking on this link golden boy i know what you're trying to do sean you get me i do i fully understand you i think i got a pair of shit right okay this is the worst pair of sneakers i got and i don't think it, i don't even think it's bad it's just like You got the red bottom boots. Okay. Sugar mama hooked you up. Like, for example, right? I'm never going to wear these. They were a gift, though. I'm never going to wear them. It's not old brother. It's just some shit where it's like, okay, so look. It's not about flat. No, no, no. Not, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. I'm just, I was just showing you because it, they just happen to be in here. They just happen to be in here, bro. Um, 
what size are you? I'm like a 10 and a half, 11 in some shoes. Some shoes just a regular 10, but some shoes like 11 and a half, you know? You feel me? Um, yeah, but like these, I'm, I'm probably never going to wear these, you know? They were gifted. I mean, it seemed like it would be up my alley, but it's really not for real. But I, I know I could put it together with a whole bunch of shit. I don't wear Ricks. I don't wear Ricks, you know what I'm saying? Um, you saying ugly as fuck, but I know you couldn't wear them. You know what I'm saying? I know you couldn't wear them. So that's why I don't really take certain niggas serious when it comes to, like, you know, shoe attire and shit like that. Like these, for example. I don't even know. Like these, you know what I'm saying? This could go with, like, a classier kind of cut. Nothing too crazy. Or I could do some um, a specific style of joggers with these. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't really know. And I and I, th I get it. You know, like, it's not in a lot of niggas' pedigree to understand certain shit. You know, summertime come around. Uh, summertime come around. I'm gonna probably be hitting niggas with these. You know what I'm saying? I know you don't like them because you couldn't. You don't understand what the vibe is. And I think that's cool. You know what I'm saying? Summertime come around. I'm gonna be hitting the love up with these. You know what I'm saying? I got the black ones too. You know, you need to just make sure you got a little variation in your life. If I really wanted to flex on niggas, I would go upstairs and grab my shit. But I'm good. Those. You know, I'm good. Re realistically speaking, I'm good. You know. Oh, I still don't like him to fuck. Yeah, I mean, that's cool because, I mean, it's a lot of shit that a lot of niggas wouldn't like because they don't understand it. They wouldn't get it. And that's cool, bro. But when you put it together with an outfit and you actually go crazy, then you understand. But you looking at a shoe alone, not having an outfit in mind, just means that you're not a fashion visionary. And I don't expect anything more from you. You're really a broke ass sure, nigga. Trust look up in your own time it's unfortunate. brand called Hoke. They are a running shoe brand. They're comfortable shoes and slides. What happened? No, I mean, I, like, all love, obviously. Like, all love, obviously. I would never want you to feel excluded or nothing like that. But I just don't think that you understand, you know? So, like, it's like, why waste my time understand, like trying to explain that to niggas when I really just, you just wouldn't get it. Like, on some Joaquin Phoenix shit, you just wouldn't understand, you know? <clears throat> no, I didn't get him. I didn't get him. You a broke-ass nigga. All love, my brother. Nigga had to immediately cop it after he said it. he couldn't just stand on that. Wow. What do I think about Draco slides? I actually hate them. Yeah, I don't like them like that. So you remember that time a while ago you told us you were broke? Indubitably. I didn't say I bought any of that. I said it was gifted. I didn't say I bought any of that. You know? If I showed you the shit that I was gifted, you would think that I have rich friends. Because I just, I don't, I would never buy that for my, like, bro, come on. Come on. You think, you think. You bro, come on. You think that I would look at my chat and see y'all like and not be like, yo, let's spread the really? You really think I would do that? Bro, if I look, if I act like, bro, we are all collectively like eating, bro. Like if that I just would never do something like that, bro. You cannot gaslight me any longer, bro. Come on. I would not do that, bro. Look, I have a mansion. Chat, what's that mean? We have a mansion. I got a million in my account. Chat, we got a million in our account. I buy a chain. Chat, we got a chain. Simple. Simple, bro. I would never, I would never, I'm not even doing that. So we staying over? Can you say, hey, I didn't hear you. Let me borrow the community chain. I, we don't have the chain yet because we're not rich enough to afford a chain. Like, but once we are, we all get to wear it whenever we feel like it. Promise. Why are you putting cap? Long as we wait, as long as you wear it first, you can't even wear the shoes. You wouldn't understand the chain. What you talking about? Okay, then buy me a house. No, no, no. I said if. I didn't say I was there. I said if. Chat, I just literally showed you uh, when Playboy Cardi mentioned what he mentioned. I literally showed you my bank account. I literally showed you, bro. Negative 20. Negative 20. Negative 20. Negative 20. Like, I'm deep in the hole. I'm so deep you can't even see me. I'm deeper than most of y'all toys that y'all be playing with. Shit crazy. Call dibs on the chain. There's no chain, bro. Sorry. But if I had a chain that I was going to get, it would be a custom piece that says semen. Shout out to all my gay niggas. You feel me? Because I love y'all like that. Chat gonna live together? Um, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna, you know, we gonna make it all, like, work together. We will. Y'all just gotta come up with the money for it. When you, once we all come up with the money, um, 
I'm gonna go on a little vacation and then because I gotta get the house for everybody else, like everybody to collectively stay in. But I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna be back. Once once the money is retrieved, like bro, we all good. I just gotta I, I gotta talk to a couple people, get the house set up and everything like that. Then I'm I'm gonna be right back. I pro I promise. When have I broke a promise, chat? When? Never, bro. All the girlies, but you niggas. Wait, I'm not included in that group of niggas, bro. Like, I'm I can be I, I'm be I'm gonna be in the house. Y'all all gonna have y'all own room, and then I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna go in like per day, like night per night day. I'm gonna walk into each room, you know, and we gotta we gotta make sure that like each room is livable. So like, you gonna get a room, and then like somebody else gonna have a room not far not far down. But I'm gonna go in those rooms, like stay a night each person, and then we like, you know, we gotta experience the room like together. You know what I'm saying? But like we can arrange that. I promise you. We'll be good. DJ what? You want to spend? That's what I'm saying. Y'all get, you going to get special rooms. I'm going to just, like, you know how you, your first night in a new crib, you got to lay in it, but you need people to lay in it with you so that you're not, like, afraid or nothing like that. Like, first, first night in type shit. And I'm going to, you know, I'm going to be there with you, you know? Like, on some comforting shit like hand around the waist you know snuggle snuggle bunny i'm gonna I'm have a we gonna um get those 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 oh, i forgot what they're called they're like these cup hold the basement yeah but like nothing crazy bro i promise <clears throat> why are you calling me dj envy you can't have our cheeks, nigga. Like, <laughs> I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna say too much. Sean, one more question: Where's my green vintage wash-up zip-up hoodie from? What hoodie are you talking about? What hoodie? What hoodie? What hoodie do you mean? I don't know what hoodie you talking about. What the fuck? Three inches of snow ahead. When did this happen? Oh my God, we're getting snow. That's not enough though. Three to five. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? watch in effect for Livingston County as well as Lapeer and Sanilac County and this goes until Saturday morning Nigga. at some point we'll probably get upgraded to a winter storm warning and the counties to the south if anything probably a winter weather advisory is what I'm thinking but behind that behind the scenes I think the bigger issue with this storm isn't going to be so much how much rain or snow we're going to get it's going to be the winds because we're expecting Arctic air to come in and you do not want to lose power before that happens right well check out fuck you mean lose power Nah, if I lose, <laughs> I'm not losing power. The wind gust here. Friday evening, we'll have wind gusts up to 30 to 40 miles per hour. And then once we go into your Saturday morning, are you doing all winds that? could peak easily up to the upper 40s to around 50 miles per hour. So that's a high end uh, wind advisory or high wind warning criteria. So we'll have to keep an eye on this because that's going to be the case for Friday night into Saturday. While that's all taking place, yes, we are talking about some snow. Thinking we could pick that up Friday night into Saturday. It's going to mix up some rain, but once we get the Chad, we we gonna, we gonna be good. We gonna be the accumulation going. I'm thinking the best likelihood of that happening will be Friday night into Saturday morning. So looking at that, the blast of winter, the best likelihood of picking up six inches of snow or more. It's going to be to the north where those winter storm warning. Damn, I'm getting five inches. No consent. Or watch criteria is currently literally didn't ask for this guy. I literally just defended you for real. They located three to five inches of snow will be a good bet for a good chunk of Metro Detroit. And once you get south of, say, M59 along the I-94 corridor, thinking about two to four inches here because we have some rain that's going to cut into those totals. And even the temperatures being above freezing will be an issue once the system gets. Oh, started. my God. Once that out, uh, check out what happens as far as the temperatures. Highs only around Island. It's just getting started. What? Supposed to dip below zero for most of the country. Hey, what the week. fuck is wrong with you? 18 degrees. 
But let's focus on this wind chill. We're expecting those numbers to go sub zero for a good portion of next. What the fuck? Fuck you mean negative 11? This is the shit that I'm talking about. Why is it happening in the middle of January? You had your time in December. This is why I don't like, like, bro, this, we gonna get hit with everything at the end of the fucking season. Why are you putting porn links in here? Who is skinny, long dick nigga? Get, ban him, ban. What are you doing? It's not the middle. It's the, it's over. Once March get here, we're finished. You're done. Why did you just send her a porn link? Next week, so hopefully we don't lose power on Saturday. Oh my god. What do you mean, oh my god? We good, we good, bro. We good. It was blowing crazy when I, like the other day. It was blowing so crazy. We're not in the center. No, we're not. You're lying. You're lying. That's not how winter works, bro. It's not how it works. Yo, sure, Nick, you won't want to get out of bed when it's cold. Fuck you. FR. So if you hire me, it'll make you daily bed in breakfasts. Bro, the last thing I would want is a grown ass man feeding me in my time of need. Climate change is real. You know what's not real? You in this chat. That's what's not real. You're not very bright. Are you trying to say, are you trying to talk about my skin complexion? I always knew you was a fuck nigga, bro. You was really white hiding behind this shit the whole time. Today we are in Whoa, Did you bro. just link your exclusive page? That's how you got rich, huh? Exclusive page? What? What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about, bro. I don't know what you're talking about, bro. You're chatting. Um, I Wait, wanted to so see. I'm oh my God, Gordon! You do know that winter starts in December and ends in March. Tay, March. please, bro. Being a Nikki fan keeps me educated. No, it doesn't. If anything, being educated is worse because you know better, but you refuse to do better. You bitch ass nigga. Now let me hear Gordon Ramsay, the realest nigga alive, talk about what he would eat for his last meal. I also would like to see him make it, pussy. I'm Gordon Ramsay, and my last meal would be. A full English breakfast, uh, butter chicken, chicken wings, and an In-N-Out burger. He eat In-N-Out? I knew he was just like me. Is that a beef Wellington? Oh, my.